Apothlody Texts, translated by E.W. West, Part 3, Dina'i Ma'inogi Karad, Clareton, Oxford University Press, 1885, Chapter 57. The sage asked the spirit of wisdom thus, Wherefore is it, when the knowledge and sagacity of the spiritual and worldly existences, both united, are connected with thee? The spirit of wisdom answered thus, For this reason, because from the first, I, who am the innate wisdom, apart from the spiritual and worldly existences, have been with Auharmazd, and the creator Auharmazd created Ephrido, the angels of the spiritual and worldly creations, and all the other creatures and the creations through the power and mightiness, the wisdom and sagacity of innate wisdom, and I produce, and he maintains and stimulates them. And at the end of the renovation of the universe, it is possible to cause the annihilation and destruction of the harmon and his miscreations more fully by the power of wisdom. And so shans with ka'i kusro'i and those who the resurrection and future existence are able to act more fully by means of the power and help of wisdom. The knowledge and sagacity of the worldly existence, the learning and teaching in every profession, and all advancement of temporal beings are through wisdom. The souls of the righteous in escaping from hell and coming to heaven and the supreme heaven, the Rodman, arrive much better by means of the power and protection of wisdom, and it is possible to seek the good living, pleasure, good repute, and every happiness of people in the worldly existence through the power of wisdom, and the maintenance of the seeds of men and beasts of burden, oxen and sheep, and also every other creature and creation of Uharmaz, the Lord, the seeding of them in the womb and making manifest what is their food in the womb, so that they shall not die from hunger and thirst, and the allotment and maturing of the limbs are effected more fully by means of the durability, dorangari, and the great potency, which are in the force of wisdom. The arrangement of the earth and the mingling of the water in the earth the growth and increase of plants, color of various kinds, and the scent, taste, and pleasantness of various things are allotted and produced more fully through wisdom. And the arrangement of alborers around the world, the manifestation of the earth, of the seven regions, and the sky above, the mountain of alborers, the motion of the sun and moon, and twelve constellations, the six times of the season festivals, the sun bar, the five times devoted to the guardian spirits, Rabardikan, the heaven, which is in the place of the good thoughts, the place of the good words, the place of the good deeds, and the perfect supreme heaven, Grodman, of all gloriousness, the path of the spirits and worldly existences, and the Kinbar bridge are produced and allotted through the power of wisdom. The watery looking clouds seizing water from the sea, advancing in the atmosphere, and gradually breaking away, drop by drop, to the earth, and Auharmazd's creatures, thoroughly understanding the nature of heaven and hell, the compassion of Auharmazd, the archangels and other angels, as regards their own creatures, and the devastation and destructiveness of Aharman, and the demons as regards the creatures of Auharmazd, it is possible to comprehend through the more complete power of wisdom. And the good religion of the Mazda worshippers, the sayings and teachings of the spirits, and the demons demolishing the worldly body and making it imperceptible by the sight of men are apprehended more fully by means of the most perfect means of wisdom. And even the struggle 
and warfare of Iran with foreigners, Un uh, Iran, and the smiting of Aharman and the demons, it is possible to effect through the power of wisdom. To occasion. The sun's inspection of the hidden water also below the earth. It is expedient to convey it for tillage and cultivation and the advantage, comfort, and enjoyment of men and beasts of burden, oxen and sheep, through the power of wisdom. The thorough understanding of the pain and sickness of men and beasts of burden, oxen, sheep, and other animals, and the bringing of medicine and remedies, health of body and comfort unto them, are much more possible to effect by means of the power of wisdom. And as to every man whose participation in wisdom is, much a share of heaven is then much more. Even as to Vistasp, Zartust, Gagyomard, and those others whose share of heaven was much the more, it was on account of the much coming of wisdom unto them. And as to Yim, Fredun, Kaius, and those other rulers who obtained splendor, Margo, and mightiness, Tagaki, from the sacred beings, just as the participation of this Tasp and other rulers in the region occurred, and their not attaining to the religion. And also, as to the times when they had become ungrateful unto their own lord, it was on account of the little coming of wisdom unto them. At a harmon also, and the demons deceive that man more, and lead him to hell, who is poorer of wisdom, and unsteadier in disposition. And it is manifest that unto him who is virtuous in disposition, habit, and demeanor, praise is then due, owing to his maintenance of wisdom. For it is declared that a harmon shouted to Zaratust thus, If thou desist, from this good religion of the Mazda worshippers, then I will give thee a thousand years to begin of the worldly existence, as was given to the Vatican monarch de Hoc. On account of complete wisdom, the virtuous disposition and demeanor of Zaratust, not having hearkened and not being deluded, he did not become deceived and longing through that temptation of the accursed evil one, the wicked, and he spoke to a harman. Thus, I will shatter and cause to ruin Dukanam, and will make downcast Nigu Isar for thee the bodies of your demons and fiends. Wizards and witches, through the home and sacred twigs, and the good true religion which the creator Auharmazd has taught to me. A Harman, when those words were heard by him, the king confounded and stupefied and rushed to hell and remained confounded a long time. And this too is declared that Auharmazd, when a Harman, by agreement, had further operated with his Auharmazd's creatures and creation of every kind, afterwards formed an assembly with angels and archangels of every kind, and the welfare of Adi, due to his own wisdom, was mentioned and recounted by him. And this too is declared that for nine thousand years of renovation until the resurrection and future existences, wisdom maintains and stimulates the creatures and creation of every kind. And this too it is declared that as to him who is an ignorant and bad-tempered man, when he attains even to much eminence, opulence, and authority, even then he is not fit to elevate into that welfare and authority. And 33 is a particular number referring to development and stuff, so it's, it's interesting that possibly the reasons of stopping development are with the number 32. The 9,000 years of renovation, so in all versions, but as the renovation is generally considered as confined 
the end of the 9,000 years, we ought perhaps to transpose the words and read for the 9,000 years until the renovation, resurrection, and future existence. And verse 30. Angels and archangels of every kind. Such an assembly is mentioned in Vendadad chapter 2, verse 42, but its proceedings are not stated. Well, overly listing of the angels and stuff could lead to, you know, even more time of people's worship being taken away from worshiping God directly and instead worshiping the angels. So, I understand. Or it could be so vast that it wasn't re-recorded in this book, what they were referring to, because there's some pretty big texts that aren't generally taught or available. Had further operated, that is, transformed and vitiated them, the Avestan Fra Kerentad, Vendadad 1.7, describing the modifying work of the evil spirit upon creation as here expressed by Frago Vadund. So counter-creation is basically a redirecting. By agreement, the covenant between the good and evil spirits, by which their conflict was limited to 9,000 years, see Bundes 1, 18 and 19. 9 is a very um, relevant number in terms of the demons, you know, because Engram and Inyu Ganog Manog is his agent, and you know, the seven, Akamana, and you know, the others. And 28, the true religion which the creator of Uharmazd has taught to me. Okay, the sacred twigs. The Barasom, the Avestan, Barasma, is a bundle, a bundle of slender twigs or wires prepared in a particular manner to be held in the left hand of the priest while reciting certain parts of the liturgy. See that ascended in Eek, 43, verse 5. Through the home, a plant growing in Persia, small twigs of which are pounded in water, and the resulting juice is tasted by the priest during the ceremonial. It is a symbol of the mythical home, the producers, the producer of immortality. See chapter 62, verse 28. Originally, don't doubt the home, Haoma, and the Sanskrit Soma were the same plant. See that is standing to Neek, 48, verse 16. Well, um, the base combination would have been the same. And perhaps, you know, things to enhance it or things just to throw in some nutritional thing while we're doing this might as well. You know, um, maybe the Indians had that too. But there is a recipe for the Haoma which, in addition to the opium, the fetter, and marijuana, has 37 other plants. And some of these enhance the high. Um, some of them are rather nutritional, solely in itself, but, um, but by immortality, it may not refer to the physical body. Downcast, Nigu, Isar, for thee, L19 has, and will make withered, Nizar, and isn't it Aleister Crowley's Book of the Law, Isar, is the sufferer, or something like that, or, oh, oh, was it Esau, the, is it the rune, or are they talking about Jesus? You know, the rune that's just a straight line. Anyways, um, cause to run, Dukanam, L19 has Va, Vanom, and I will smite. 26, the wicked. This section is a good deal altered in the Bazan version, but the general meaning is the same. 25, Monarch, Dahak. See chapter 8, verse 29. And the wicked, okay, this section altered a lot in the Bazan version, but the general meaning is the same. Well, sometimes when you go from one language to the next, you have to 
do a lot with it, right? Vatican. As the Vadak is said in Dennis Sandy Danik, 72.5, to have been the mother of Dahak, this term may be a metronymic, implying son of Vadak. Shouted to Zarathust. Well, I guess the demons shout and stuff, but yeah, um, hence the Gothaya, you know, the Goetia, implying some sort of howling or something. Different language, but you know. This is stated in other words in Vendadad 1923 32. And verse 23 and demeanor. L19 has virtuous in disposition and virtuous of demeanor. Verse 9, have become ungrateful unto their own lord. They all three suffered misfortunes in their old age, attributed by the priesthood to neglect. BF, religion, which is here traced to diminution of intellect. Well, yeah, at some point there's not going to be the person there that has intelligence to are the, that type of ability to remember the stuff and pass it on. And other rulers in the religion occurred. This clause occurs only in K-43. And mightiness. Oh, anyways. And those other rulers who obtained splendor, Bargo and mightiness, tagak e L-19 has opulence. Ka'i'us, see chapter 8, 27, where all three are mentioned. Fredun and Yim, the other. And verse 20. Whose share of heaven was much the more? L19 has who more fully obtained a share of heaven? Gayomard, see chapter 27 2 Zaratust see chapter 110 Vistasp see chapter 13 14 more possible to effect L19 omits to effect and verse 15 making it Imperceptible by the sight of men are apprehended. Reading Giri Hasto L19 has R affected. Teaching of the spirits L19 has worldly existences. The more complete power L19 has more fully through the power. And Auharmonst's creatures. The Sanskrit version adds and Harmons and gradually breaking away. The Pothlavi in verse 14 there has Viktano, who is more probably connected with the Persian Kikton to break than with the Persian Pikton to sift. The watery looking, assuming that Ma Venako stands for Ma Ya. The Nako and the Kinvar Bridge, see chapter 2, 115, by omitting and, Naryo Sung identifies this bridge with the path mentioned before, if, but it forms only one portion of the path to the other world. The four grades of heaven are the place of good words, the place of Oh, the place of good thoughts, the place of good words, the place of good deeds, and the perfect supreme heaven, Grodman, of all gloriousness. See chapter 7, 9 through 12. The five times devoted to the guardian spirits. Favardikan. The five supplementary days, named after the five Gathas, or sacred hymns, which follow the twelfth month in order to complete the Parsi year of 365 days, together with the five preceding days, 
They are especially devoted to the homage of the guardian spirits, our Fabashis. And perhaps there might have been a sixth at some point. You know, six holidays, six extra days. Um, would have made sense. The season festivals, the sun bar. See chapter four, five. And further in verse 13. In 12 constellations, the signs of the zodiac, whose apparent movement due to the motion of the earth is here alluded to. The earth of the seven regions, see chapter 9, 2. The arrangement of Alburs, 44, 16. Of durability, Durangari, and the great potency which are in the force. See, well, L19 has by means of the great potency and force. 44, 16, force. Um, the maturing of the limbs are affected. Reading Vadurni Hend, L19 has, are possible to affect. The seeding of them. Naryo Song has read. Sha Yastan, possibly instead of Nishastano, seating. Verse 9, and coming. L19 omits and coming. In escaping from hell, that is, escaping from the risk of being sent to hell. Verse 8, and all advancement of temporal beings. L19 has times, teaching in, L19 has of, Ka'i Kusro'i, see chapter 2, 95, and 27, 63, Soshans, see chapter 2, 95, and 27, 63, verse 5, and I produce, so, in K43, but Nair Yosong has taken this verb in the third person in place of the nearly synonymous Afrido, so as to state that the Creator created, maintains, and stimulates the angels and all other existences through the power of innate wisdom. The object of the Potomi text, however, seems to be to emphasize the fact that the creation was specially due to the innate wisdom of the Creator, while its maintenance is dependent on all his powers and attributes.